Hi, and welcome to the Wesley Orthodontics YouTube page. My name is Brittany. I am one of Dr. Wesley's chair side assistants, and today I'm going to show you how to fit, how to floss your fixed retainer. Um, I have fixed retainers on my upper and lower arch put there by Dr. Wesley, so I make the perfect candidate to show you how to do this. To floss, what you will need is a floss gutter and any type of floss you like to use at home. You want to take your floss gutter, take the floss, thread it through the loop, Pull your small end through. I usually like to hold my small end in my pinky or my finger so I don't lose it. The next thing you're going to have to do, I'm gonna explain it and then show you, is you're gonna take your floss threader, find the V point in your gum, and kind of wiggle the threader through until it will feed all the way through to the other edge. All right, once you've got your floss threaded through both sides of your retainer, you want to take the floss and do a C curve to each side, making sure to floss each tooth efficiently. Then, as you saw, you want to delicately hold your finger in place and slide the floss out to make sure you're not pulling up against the retainer, which can damage it. Um, once you're done with that one, you usually have, with our fixed retainers, they're canine to canine. So you want to go inside your canine teeth all the way across the other inside of your canine tooth. Now, as you saw, the angulation on the lower is kind of on an upward direction. For the upper retainer, it is a little bit different, so I'm also going to floss my upper retainer for you. Same thing, just take the floss sweater, thread your floss straight through, pull that in, and then again, I'm going to do the same thing without explaining it to you, but just showing you how to do it on the top. All right, again, top one, you have to do canine all the way over to other canine where your fixed retainer is placed. And now if it is in a different place, sometimes we only do it for the front four teeth because fixed retainers can take a lot of bite force on the canines. Biggest thing, um, try to floss this at least four times a week. It's gonna keep it healthy, it's gonna keep it clean. It's gonna ensure that when you go in for your regular six month cleanings that the hygienist isn't telling you this is a bad retainer choice for you. Dr. Wesley would not have put this retainer on if he did not feel that it would work best for you in your treatment. Um, big thing too, if there's any problems with it, please call our office. We will definitely help you out and we can demonstrate that for you with your own fixed retainer in the office. Thanks for subscribing and tuning in and look forward to some other videos we will be posting to this page soon.